Good morning. Today it's Saturday morning and we are back with Rax the Home Chef part 16 and this episode is named Is Becca Pregnant? So we start today's episode with looking at Mark when he is painting away in the little spare room. And here's Becca as well, talking and flirting a bit with her husband. Well, that's allowed, isn't it? In today's episode, they will travel and they will dumpster dive. Because now, this is the only room in the house that they still need to furnish before they can set ahead for their 20,000 simoleon. Because then, this series will end. I know that in like the last two episodes, I might have said like 50,000, but then I went back and listened to the first episode and I actually decided 20,000 because that's what I said. Okay, Becca, come on, let's make some waffles as well. Now she started making pizza and now some plain waffles and then she's going to put them in her inventory because then she can take a snack and maybe they can have like a picnic when they go away to Evergreen Harbor. We well, have to empty it, love. Look at her going. She has very perky steps. Nice. The pizza's done, put in her inventory. The waffles are done and put in her inventory. Success. Okay, while she was cooking, Mark was in the bathroom because it's like a skill day or something. So he needs to get a new social skill. And I try in front of the mirror, but I don't know if that's the way to go because I try to practice charisma and stuff like that, but it doesn't seem to approve his skills at all. I look at him now, his hand was like outside the window, but looks like he's acting. Okay. A dirty plate. Look, the plate was so white that you couldn't even see it against that glass table in the kitchen. Come on, come on, try. Is that... Well, he reached level... He, he went up a level, but the skill is says, still says zero to one. But I don't know what to do then. Seriously. Maybe we need to practice charisma in a different way. Oh, he's exhausted and so is she. So Becca, go to bed and your hubby can sleep on the couch. Clement, oh, Father Christmas is calling. So Mark, get up because you have company. Father Christmas is coming for a visit. No, no, Mark, you are not supposed to go to bed. You were supposed to greet Father Christmas. Well, now Father Christmas is out in the small restaurant part listening to some music. That's right, Mark. Get up. Oh, you have final grades now, Becca. Okay. Would you like to sign up for another term? No, we do not sign up for another term because this is our life now. We have gotten married and we're starting a family. At least we hope we are, since the episode is named Is Becca Pregnant? But you need to fix the room and you need to reach that 20,000 simoleon level. Then I hope you can have a baby. So we are trying now to make joy jokes, tell funny stories, to see if we can add to that skill up in the left corner. But I don't know. Santa doesn't look impressed at all. Oh, okay. Was that a funny story? I don't know. Well, still zero out of one. I don't know how to do that. But now let's go to bed to sleep next to your wifey. And come on, Santa, it's time to leave now. Well, I saw it. The door opened and Santa, well, he came in again. I don't understand. Well, now it's the next morning and the couple is having breakfast. Some leftovers from the fridge. And now Mark wants them both 
to travel to Evergreen Harbor so they can scavenge the dumpster for some nice prices or maybe some nice furniture who knows <coughs> and here we are oh are you feeling romantic oh hold me closer of course you like physical intimacy you're married and you're young you're so young I mean what happened to my picture what's happening do you see that flickering light oh, maybe my eyes are just getting older well now they are diving for <clears throat> some love making in the dumpster and we clicked try to have baby in dumpster because she is very flirty and she's in a perfect age to get pregnant I think but maybe we can look somewhere else while the couple <clears throat> is enjoying themselves oh they're finished so you can't Oh, I was clicking on a dumpster to see if he could start searching for some deals, diving for some deals. But the dumpster was already taken. But good job, Becca. Here you go. You f Oh, you found money, Becca. And what about... And let's see, Mark, what can you find in the dumpster? When you finish that dumpster, you can go to the next one. Oh, she found money, or was it he? Oh, she, oh, Becca found some coloring, some colors. So when they make like rugs or lamps or whatever, they can put color on them. But now, Becca, I want you to see if you are pregnant. Oh, those were your final grades. Would you like to sign up for another term? No, we don't. Did you get that question once more? Why? Why would you get that question again? Well. Anyways, maybe they really wanted to make sure from the university. Oh, who are you standing next to, Becca? Oh, now you're really dirty. Yes, you are. You're filthy, so let's go into the bathroom and see if you're pregnant and then take a shower. You've got such perky steps. Let's see. Oh, but, oh hi, Mark. Are you also in here to see the big news? <gasps> Eating for two! Congrats! Oh! Oh! Hooray! Oh honey, I'm pregnant! Oh, I knew that. I've already figured that one out. Okay. So now, get into a shower. And since you guys are married, pregnant, he doesn't even have to leave the bathroom. Okay. Oh honey, honey, I'm so happy. Oh, let's go home and get some sleep and just celebrate the baby. Yes, love, we will. So, have a nice day to you all. Bye.